दिस इज क्वेश्चन हंड्रेड टेन पार्ट वन रेवेन्यू फ्रॉम ऑपरेशन इज गिवेन कैश सेल्स एंड क्रेडिट सेल्स रिटर्न ऑफ सेल्स इज गिवेन कॉस्ट ऑफ रेवेन्यू फ्रॉम ऑपरेशन इज गिवेन कैलकुलेट ग्रॉस प्रॉफिट रेशियो ओके फाइन हंड्रेड टेन पार्ट वन ग्रॉस प्रॉफिट रेशियो इज इक्वल टू ग्रॉस प्रॉफिट अपन नेट सेल्स इंटू हंड्रेड दैट इज इक्वल टू कैश सेल्स प्लस क्रेडिट सेल्स माइनस सेल्स रिटर्न माइनस कॉस्ट ऑफ गुड सोल्ड यू नो दिस इज ए वेरी कॉमन फॉर्मूला टू फाइंड आउट ग्रॉस प्रॉफिट अपन नेट सेल्स इज कैश सेल्स प्लस क्रेडिट सेल्स माइनस सेल्स रिटर्न इंटू हंड्रेड दैट इज इक्वल टू रुपीज टू लैक्स अपन रुपीज टेन लैक्स into 100 that is equal to 20% 20% is gross profit ratio second one second one is average inventory is rupees 160000 inventory turnover ratio 6 times selling price 25% above cost calculate gross profit ratio to working notes inventory turnover ratio is equal to कॉस्ट ऑफ रेवेन्यू फ्रॉम ऑपरेशंस अपन एवरेज इन्वेंट्री नाउ वी हैव बीन गिवन इन्वेंट्री टर्न ओवर रेशियो सिक्स टाइम्स इज इक्वल टू कॉस्ट ऑफ रेवेन्यू फ्रॉम ऑपरेशंस अपन एवरेज इन्वेंट्री रुपीज वन लाख सिक्सटी थाउजेंड नाउ कॉस्ट ऑफ रेवेन्यू फ्रॉम ऑपरेशन विल बी फाउंड आउट बाई क्रॉस मल्टीप्लाइंग रुपीज वन लाख सिक्सटी थाउजेंड विथ सिक्स टाइम्स दैट इज इक्वल टू रुपीज नाइन लाख सिक्सटी थाउजेंड Now we got got cost of revenue from operations, and after getting this, it is written selling price twenty five percent above cost. Hence, cost twenty five percent is gross profit. That is equal to sales is equal to cost of goods sold plus gross profit. That is equal to cost of goods sold plus it is written selling price is twenty five percent above cost. This above. Above of cost is gross profit. That is equal to rupees nine lakh sixty thousand plus rupees nine lakh sixty thousand into twenty five percent. That is equal to rupees nine lakh sixty thousand plus rupees two lakh forty thousand. That is equal to rupees twelve lakhs. Now sales is equal to cost of goods sold plus gross profit. That is equal to implies that sales is rupees twelve lakhs. That is equal to cost of goods sold is rupees nine lakh sixty thousand plus gross profit. Implies that gross profit is equal to rupees two lakh forty thousand. We got gross profit. We have got sales. Now we can find out gross profit ratio in the fair notes. Gross profit ratio is equal to gross profit upon Net revenue from operations into hundred, that is equal to rupees two lakh forty thousand upon rupees twelve lakhs into hundred, that is equal to twenty percent. Then third one, in the working notes we have to solve some points. Here operating opening inventory is rupees one lakh, closing inventory is rupees sixty thousand. Inventory turnover ratio is eight times. We can find cost of revenue from operations from this. Selling price is twenty five percent above cost, same as point two. We have just solved. Now we can find out gross profit in this point and sales. Then we can find out gross profit ratio. It is same as that of the last one. Here, average stock, opening stock plus closing stock by two, that is rupees one lakh plus rupees sixty thousand by two, that is rupees eighty thousand. Inventory turnover ratio, cost of revenue from operations upon average stock or average inventory, implies that eight times is equal to cost of revenue from operations whole divided by rupees eighty thousand. Implies that cost of revenue from operations is rupees six lakh forty thousand. That is, we have to cross multiply eight times with rupees eighty thousand. That is cost of revenue from operations is equal to rupees six lakh forty thousand. Now gross profit is equal to cost of goods sold multiplied by twenty five percent. That is equal to cost of goods sold multiplied by twenty five percent. We have to write down the value of a cost of revenue from operations or cost of goods sold. One and same thing. 
rupees 640000 multiplied by 25% hence gross profit is rupees 160000 now we got gross profit we got cost of revenue from operations if we will add these two it will give rise to net sales that is sales is equal to cost of goods sold plus gross profit that equal to rupees 640000 plus rupees 160000 that is equal to rupees 8 lakhs next one is your fair notes gross profit ratio is equal to gross profit whole upon net revenue from operations into 100 that is equal to rupees 160000 upon net revenue from operations rupees 8 lakhs multiplied by 100 that is equal to 20 percent 20 percent is your gross profit ratio